Okay, so Kyle did some amazing reporting on the problem with EA chargers when it was really cold, and he did that in the uh, in the Denver area. And uh, I'm here. I've got uh, you know my Taycan here and my Rivian here. And I'll take the uh, Rivian out uh, in the snow. It's right now about negative one outside. And I'm going to try to measure at what point do the EA chargers start working again because I think we need to know that. I'm doing it at like 9 a.m. Kyle, Kyle's the man. I mean, this guy was jacked up on Red Bull at two in the morning to four in the morning, trying to figure out what's going on with EA and where we can rely on it. Uh, I'm not gonna work that hard, but uh, I am gonna try to see what we can figure out today. Okay, so he has the uh, continue, welcome Rex, continue button there, and uh, looks like it's, saw the green flash from the Rivian. And it is, it's working. Okay, so th this again, Kyle didn't have a problem with this one. Uh, this was the one that did work. And it actually at this station, it's the only one that's working. So uh, if there was more demand on that, it'd be a problem. Okay, so this- Well, we now know the big problem with the EVs. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, or EA, it seems to be the, uh, the culprit here. Yeah. But yeah, that's, uh, so the initiation error was the same one that he was getting. And I'm at like five, we're at five degrees today, so this is a lot better, but still not working. Yeah, okay, so the uh, the nightmare, I guess, of the EV is that uh, that Q is just charging there, uh, and the only charger that works is that one in the corner, which is the old Chadmo. Same thing that uh, Kyle found with that out of spec. Uh, ID4 had been waiting because they hadn't uh, had any charge at all. I mean, I came out here with a lot of charge, so I've, I just confirmed that yes, in fact, they don't work. And he had shared with me that he's tried every single one of them and called uh, Electrify America and put in a work order, but the, you know, no answer. So at five degrees, they still don't work. Um, as it gets warmer, I'll give it a try again and see at what point they do potentially come back online. Equipment related calls may be recorded or monitored for quality control purposes. Thank you for calling Electrify America. This is Kristen. How may I assist you? Yeah, I'm uh, not able to get a charge out here at a station. I want to see if potentially you could uh, reset it and see if that might help. Okay, I was just uh, helping the guy out on the IX there. Volvo doesn't work, the Volkswagen and the Rivian. So n nothing, nothing here works. And, uh, Shows available, but but they're really not available. So the I'm gonna head back now that I've tested. That was at nine degrees, uh, and I had them reset it just to see if maybe at a warmer degree it would reset. But these are all the way out. Um, and Electrify America and the earlier one thought it was uh, up and available at the last location at the uh, Wheat Ridge, but at this uh, Cedar Mills. Um, they have this now labeled as all out, but it doesn't show that on any of the chargers. So um, yeah, EVgo or the old the old ones that with the Chadmo, um, those are still working for anyone who needs help. I wanna thank Kyle for bringing attention to this issue. What he does without a spec is a really service to the whole EV industry. And Electrify America, I hope you take this in the spirit of a defect is a treasure. This is a problem. And if you can fix it, we will be grateful. And I, for one, have a contract with you through Porsche where I'm counting on you to be available for me for road trips. And on the Rivian, I don't directly have a contract, but I count on EA for a lot of those road trips. And I want to be able to go up to the mountain and enjoy the snow and skiing and snowshoeing and all the things that, that nature has to provide. But I need to be able to count on the fact that in cold weather I can get back home. And EA is a very big part of the equation. I love the fact that the, these units do work here, but that's one out of four in most stations. And that EVgo and some of the slower speed charge point are also still working. But this is a problem you have to solve. While I was out and about, I did check my range and I'll be sharing that in a future video.